Hello everyone, it's Desk Shadow again, and then we're back to survival. Um, that was weird. Um, so I'm going back to working on my farm. This is the, oh no, this is anyone here. You know, I think I'll just build this farm for now and worry about efficiency later. Because the point is, there really is no point in this farm other than aesthetics. Because, oop, oop, I did not mean to do that. Um, because there's no point in getting food because I have enough already. I don't know how it tells me I have outdated mods if I don't even have an internet connection. Does it remember from that? Um, actually, you want, I think I probably will build an efficient farm. Let me just set everything up first. Right now, I need dirt first. Let me see how I want to do this. Um, Wait, 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 I know what to do, I know what to do. Um, I can create a very efficient farm from just one block of water. I'm, I'm going to have to expand my farm a lot if I want to do that. And I'm out of dirt too. Okay, so I'm going to go down after, and then I'm also going to expand my farm. Oh, oh. Uh, one block over and that would have been bad. Yeah, um... Why, I'm just going to build this and take a look at Oh yeah, sorry for the, um, too many items slot open. I was testing worlds before. And if that's turned off, and before you start saying, Hey, wait, you're cheating, you were cheating, you were... Yeah, well, I don't... You can look at my inventory by going back. You can look at my chest, which I'm going to lay there. I didn't give myself any advantages whatsoever. I just used it in the previous world. So I'm going to collect all this dirt here. I think I'm going to go for a stack because I'm going to be plant building another farm before and plant um, melons and pumpkins. Um, hold on a moment, but I need to change my microphone settings. This isn't working out well. All right, I changed my microphone settings to make it a little more sensitive because it kept on filtering my voice's background noise. Um, I think I have enough dirt for now. I'll explore the cavern that off. I'll explore the cavern I saw later. It's, night is falling, so I'm going to have to get back to bed. I don't think I'm going to sleep off. Um, until I have... Oh, look at that baby outside. It's so cute. Um, anyway, sorry. I'm going to wait until I have slightly better armor and weapons before I decide to venture out into the night. I just don't feel safe with the current gear that I have now. So, I'll sleep in my arm. And I installed the Mimo Brony mod, so I'm going to make the element of loyalty. I just feel like that element fits me the most. That's not how you do it. Um. That's not how you do it either. How do you do this thing? Um, hang on. Um, I'm looking up online. I, I ah, shoot. Okay, you know, I gotta edit this, this part out. I, I need to get internet connection. I need to stop Minecraft to do that. Otherwise, it'll freeze up. Hang on. Alright everyone, I'm back. I found out how to build an element of loyalty. And it's built like 
this, but it's not look like a necklace at all, amulet, whatever you want to call it. But I want to try to provide a tiny bit more armor. Huh? Looking good, looking good. All right then. Let's go out and work on the farm. Let's see. Sir. Oh, it's too short of a full stack. Let's see, that's a center. No, is that a center? No, that's not going to be the center. Okay, I'm going to have to expand this farm a little. Oh, oh my god, I did not complete that platform. I, would I have fallen into the water? I'm losing some wood, but it's an expendable resource as opposed to dying. There. Okay. So I'm going to expand this into the most efficient farm I can. If you didn't know already, with a block of water at the, um, with block of water, it can reach farmland up to four squares away. So essentially, you can build a nine by nine farm with one whole entire space. You can have up to 80 pieces of wheat or whatever you're growing. I don't know, but you can't do that with of pumpkins because you need one room for those, don't you? But anyway, um, 80 pieces of wheat, and that's a pretty good farm in my opinion. Let me see. There. Alright. Let's place it right there. No. No. I'm going to do this. There. Alright, then the rest should be... Alright. Don't stop double building. Why is he always double building? Oh yeah, so, um, <laughs> well you don't fit too much Dead Island, do you want to know how I knew that? I was in a dark place, and just like you were supposed to do in Dead Island, I tried to press T to turn my, on my flashlight. Yeah, I actually tried to press T in real life. And I'm like, oh, wait, nope, nope, what am I doing? <laughs> <sighs> Now, when Dead Island, in Dead Island, when Jin was shot, I was like, oh my gosh, Red White, I can never forgive you. I'm like, I'll tear you apart. I killed him 10 seconds flat with a sonic pulse grenade. But, um, after playing the Rider White DLC, I started to understand a little more. But the fact is, he still shot Jin, so, yeah. I still don't forgive him. I'm like, Jin was like possibly one of the most innocent souls in the game, and you just shot her. I'm like, yeah, I'm like, forgive you? Not gonna happen anytime soon. Wait, wait. No. no. That's not how you do it. Hang on. Um. Let me see. Ah, oh, I wouldn't have to move that tree out of my way, aren't I? Because can mobs spawn on leaves? Because if they do, that's hang on, let me focus in. That's gonna be a bit of a problem because they're gonna be able to trample my farm. I don't think mobs can spawn on leaves. At least I haven't seen any. So I don't think I have to worry about chopping the entire tree down. There are some of you who've told me to get the timber mod, but those are, that's one, I don't know, my opinion of cheating in Minecraft is different. I, I believe that's to be cheating. I'm like, it's supposed to take a while. I'm like, what do you think in real life you can chop down a tree in like five seconds with your fist? No, you can't. 
I want to have, I want to have at least, yeah, well, this failure, but Minecraft isn't real at all, but, <laughs> I mean, might as well try, huh? And plus, it's incompatible with too many items, at least that's what I heard, so, I wouldn't be able to get it anyway. Is that, is that, is that big enough? That's big enough. So there's a fence off there. Oh, well, you didn't even have to track down that tree. How nice. But there is something like for a server, a bucket server called Tree Feller is an ability for wood cutting level. My god, if you use that in a jungle tree, two things will happen. One, your axe will break, hurting you. It'll completely break, uncoverable. Or, um, you know, or, um, you'll get all of that jungle wood. I already own a few jungles in the server that I play on, Palcraft. Believe me, I get a lot of wood off there. I won't have problems with jungle wood anytime soon. Yeah, in Palcraft, you're allowed to claim, um, spawners, biomes, and, um, not strongholds. <laughs> oh my god, I should sure look. Um, biomes, spawners, and village, villages, that's all, where I was looking for, for yourself, if you were going to find them. Oh yeah, and nether fortresses. I own a few nether fortresses, I own like two jungles, and I own a ton of spawners. I've made them into grinders, the only one that's not public is my blaze grinder, because I I'm just making sure mobs don't spawn here. Only one that's not public is my blaze grinder because I had no idea how to do it, so I had to pay someone else in diamonds to do it. Um, 32 diamonds, yeah. And it, I didn't want to trouble him to build another one for public, and plus, why would I pay just for a public one? But for every single type of spawner there is, other than the blaze, I have a public and a private one. Why? Because I'm a nice guy like that. I'm one of the very few people that actually, um, oops, that, I meant that to be perfect. I, that actually has public grinders like that. Good. Hello, bunny. Whoa. I'm definitely going to explore that cave later. Bunny, I really hope you can swim. You just jump in the water. Ooh, spooky. Just so we don't have a some random overhang. Well, I bring another. <laughs> yeah, we'll have a hover hang. We'll just have a tree growing in the air. Oop. That should be more than enough dirt, but I'm going to collect some sand too. I need sand for glass and sugar cane. I might build a new home soon. Depends on whether I want to move from here or not. Or to have a, te a second home or a temporary home. I don't know. I, I really don't feel like moving all my resources. When the, when, I want, is there a mod that you can, oops, um, pick up chests and have all that improved. I know that's going to come in an update. Is it 1.3? I don't know. I hear rats. I should probably get back soon. Now, this is, was being filmed before the 1.3 update. So, if this is released after the 1.3 update, that's just because I filmed it before that time. Yeah, I'm going to get back. I'm not going to get killed by rats. I just rode my way off, didn't I? I did. Wow. We won't have fun in my lord's though.
I don't hear the rat anymore, so that's good. We're done. Back in the jungle. And let's go back to home and wait, no, 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 come on, come on, get up, oh look, vines grew all the way down, that's so nice. Right, sorry, I'm derping out right now. All right, I think I'll probably continue working on the farm. Is that enough torches? Will mobs spawn? I still can't believe that was just that well short. Oh, stuck to a building. I wonder how much a stone hole can take. Right, missed that one. Got it. Yeah, I can notice that the, that the water is reaching out to all that farmland. I built the most efficient farm piles. I'm going to tell the rest of the land why I need it. I really don't need it right now. There. I had 10 pieces of wheat growing. And I guess that's it for now. Um, thanks for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and auto out.